Hello again. Um, I'm wearing the same thing as I have for the last two videos, not because I'm filming this on the same day as I did the last two videos because these require no effort at all, but because I filmed these, or this one, uh, the same day that I did the other two because this requires no effort at all. Uh, let's go into Family Guy, Try Not To Laugh Challenge, Family Guy, Funniest Moments, number four. On teenage girls for a Here we go. I'm studying Meg to see what goes on during her day. Be careful you don't fall off that ladder. Not all dogs go to heaven. So, says here you're involved in the plotting of September 11th? Well, that's what they get for supporting Israel. Yuck, yuck, yuck. Gosh. Okay, into the eternal pit of fire you go. <laughs> Is there any way you can describe that to me using colorful puppets of some sort? The Nielsen box will monitor your viewing habits. I don't like the left puppet, his chin is scary. Oh, I hate the Yankees. Yeah, you are all villains to me because I happen to live in this region of the country. Yeah! What's going on? Did I miss something? Ah, just some idiot streaking across the field. Ha uh, ha, uh, you are all looking at my penis. You didn't plan on it. There's a good joke in there me. that they undercut with a naked Stephen Hawking. For no reason. I can't sleep. I'm scared of ghosts. God, it is no such thing as ghosts. Are you sure? Well, now I'm not. Come on, get in here. It's safe under here, right? I think so, but I'm not sure. I just recently started believing in ghosts. So we're, uh, thinking about selling the house. Meg, now that Lois has connections at Fox, we are going to invent our own cartoon show. And we are here to brainstorm ideas. All right, go. Anything that pops into your head. Ooh, how about a show about a bunch of disabled ducks, and we'll call it Handy Quacks. Wow, caught fire a little earlier than I thought we would. Perfect. All right, let's spend many hours on this. All right, the main duck, what's his name? I don't know, uh, Red Hiney Monkey? <laughs> I love it, I love it. All right, now what's his wacky neighbor duck's name? Giddy Goose? Meg, please try to formulate ideas clearly before you vocalize them. I'm not sure you're getting the show, Meg. All right, names, 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 come on now. <gasps> Poopy Face Tomato Nose! Yes, write it down. Hurry, 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 hurry. Maybe they live in a pond? Chris, can I talk to you in the kitchen for a sec? You know, it's really easy to animate one character sitting in a blank room doing nothing and having voiceover right, going on in the go. background. Andy Quacks, episode one, scene one. Let's get him laughing right off the bat. Interior, Red Hiney Monkey's house. What's Red Hiney Monkey doing? Um, maybe he just got up. He's making breakfast? Eh, I don't think people eat breakfast anymore. More suggestions. Ooh, what if Red Hiney Monkey and Poopy Face Tomato Nose are trying to build a house of cards and it keeps falling down? Oh, Jiminy Christmas, we have all been there. That's going in. Oh, we are cooking, 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 cooking now. All right, now let's take a walk down this road, see where it leads us. Dialogue, what are they saying? Um, maybe Poopy Face Tomato Nose says, uh, boy, this house of cards just doesn't want to stay up. Well, I mean, yeah, if you want to go right at it like a Neanderthal, sure, but I think we're shooting for a little more subtlety here, you know? I, you know, I, I, don't, I don't believe that. I don't believe that that's a real conversation when I hear it. P people don't talk like that, Meg. Ooh, ooh, what if they just bought a new wood stove and Red Hiney Monkey says, Boy, it's so hot in here because we just bought that new wood stove and we're, we're sweating, sweating and, and our hands are all slippery, slippery and that's, that's why, why we, we can't, can't get the card out to stay, stay up. up. Thank you, Chris. We have liftoff. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm, I'm so sorry, but none of this stuff seems to make sense. I mean, we haven't even referenced the fact that they're ducks or that they're handicapped, but the show You're gonna is gonna go in the kitchen again? Quacks. Uh huh. Chris, can I see you in the kitchen? Ooh. Not even watching it, I know what's happening. The animation just sucks so bad in this show. 
Look at this. Look at this. It's hilarious that we have a character sitting doing nothing, so it's easy to animate. on vacation, but poopy face tomato nose carries one all the time. And see, he's got a sleeve hanging out. He didn't pack it right. Oh, well, you know what could be funny? Maybe one week he actually goes on vacation. And he's already got the suitcase. Chris, can I see you in the kitchen for a sec? Man, it's so funny that they've gone in the kitchen three times and left Maggie sitting on the couch doing nothing, so it's easy to animate. Just have her blink every once in a while. It's fine. It looks great. Meg, your services will no longer be needed. Do you think it's safe to drink from a fire hose? Why not, Dad? It's just water. All right, we're well, turning on. I'm very thirsty. <laughs> nice job, Chris. You got my shirt wet. Now, few people realize it's pretty good. It's a boy, Mrs. Quagmire. Ah, uh, that's wonderful. How do you feel? Horny, really horny. Could you put him back so I can push him out again? I was born nine times that day. God damn it! What happened? I dropped my phone in the toilet. Oh, oh, it's so cold and it's under everything. Oh, I feel like I'm rooting around a pitcher of sangria. Oh, where is it? Oh my god, why haven't I found it yet? Oh no, I didn't roll my sleeve up far enough. Oh, why didn't I flush when I got in here? Oh, this isn't even all mine. Oh no, there's a spider crawling on my face. Oh, why didn't I use the hand that was on the floor? Why did I use my toilet hand? Oh wait, here it is behind the toilet. This is my Malibu Barbie doll that I got. Well, you should animate there, guys. She comes with a Great hairbrush, job. a pocketbook, and two different dresses. Oh my God, who the hell cares? Peter? I'm telling you guys, it's gonna be a disaster, just like the alternate ending of Back to the Future. <laughs> If I'm gonna disappear into nothing, I might as well bang my mom. Hey, Lorraine, wait up! Hi, my name's Marty. I'm in a picture. To be contenders. He said she never wants to see me again. Well, I'm sure you can come up with some excuse to see her at the vet. Is there any more coffee? <laughs> I'm here with my dog. <laughs> He's not feeling well. That was good. You. Oh. How the hell and they wrote it. Smoking. I wish smoking could just quit me instead. Thank you for meeting me here. I have something very important to tell you. I have something important to tell you too. Peter, I think we should see other people. Okay. Oh, uh, good. That's what I was going to say. Now I'm just thinking about that joke. Oh, it's over. Okay. Okay, that was the best one so far, and out of a whole, what, uh, eight minutes? Hey, stop. Eight minutes? I laughed once? So I guess I laughed, so I failed the challenge? That's stupid and dumb and doesn't matter, but I failed. So comment below if you failed as well, and what point, at what point you failed. Or if you just watched the whole thing and didn't laugh at all. Because I wouldn't blame you if you watched the whole thing and didn't laugh at all. Because the one joke that's funny is only funny in context with all the other abysmal, poorly scripted, poorly executed, trash jokes. But I'll be seeing you guys tomorrow with Family Guy. Try not to laugh challenge Family Guy funniest moments number five. See you then.